Welcome to the monthly meditation. We are so glad that you are here. And we feel like we are so blessed that you are part of our spiritual family. And Jeff and I are sending you virtual hugs. Even though we can't be together, we can still be together in spirit. And we're looking forward to the day when we can be together again and be able to connect in a physical way as well. But until then, welcome again to the monthly meditation. And what we always do is we ground ourselves and go within and let all of the cares and the worries and the fears of the world just fall away. Let them go and be present in this moment and know that we are blessed, that we are loved, and that we are taken care of and protected. And also put your intentions out there of what you'd like to receive tonight and what is for your highest good. And as you're doing that, I'm going to play the Crystal Heart Bowl. And after you've done setting your intentions, I ask that you go ahead and while I'm playing the Heart Bowl, that you send out love and light to everyone out in the world. So when you are ready, bring yourself back out to the outer world, centered and grounded, and ready to receive what is for your highest good. So now, we normally go around and introduce ourselves, but since we can't do that, we thought we would just take a moment to think about what we are grateful for and just put that energy out there in the universe and sending it to everyone out there in the world as well. Sending that grateful energy. A 
Okay, when you're ready, Brooke, go ahead and bring yourself back. Um, and I'm going to turn it over to Jeff to present the monthly meditation. This meditation is titled Embracing the Light. The light fills darkness wherever it may be. Nothing of a lower nature can exist in the light. Discordant thoughts, emotions, and energies are dissolved and dispelled by the light, for the light is the great energizer of life. We do not have to understand the light because it knows itself. In itself, it is perfect. All we need is to embrace the light within our beings. Let it flow and the light will do the rest. It is all encompassing wherever it goes, filling every nook and cranny. The light needs no directions to find its way. It brightens the path before us, making clear what was hidden. It illuminates the world around us, revealing that which serves us and that which does not. The light knows only its crystalline essence, pure, clean, and revealing, replacing doubt with assuredness, chill with warmth, and sorrow with laughter, joy, and enchantment. All is well in the light because it can be no other way. Be in the light, embrace the light, be the light. And in the likeness of the light, you will brighten your life and the life of others. Now during this meditation, you will be going to your special place of beauty, where you will spend some time enjoying its fragrance and splendor. From there, you will go to the sacred circle which acts as a portal where you may see or visit any place in creation. You will become part of a beautiful scene where you will be transported to a great cathedral. You will meet an illuminated being of light who will welcome you and prepare you for the initiation of the light. A choir of angels will consecrate you so you may receive the radiance of the divine light. The ceiling of the cathedral will slowly fade as the light from above shines down upon you like many magnificent suns. Light beings of every imaginable type will be present to watch from high above as you are christened in the radiance of the divine light. You will be raised toward the source of the light shining down with unimaginable brightness as you pass through the throngs of the many angelic beings surrounding you who rejoice at your presence. Then, in the manner that is appropriate for your being, you and your being will be immersed, connected, and saturated in the radiance of the divine light shining from the source directly above you. When complete, you will be brought gently back down to the cathedral where a golden choir of angels and other beings will continue to sing and rejoice as every part of you is saturated and glowing brilliantly like embers of divine light. You will then be given some time to remain in the presence of the angels 
with a radiance shining down from above to become further enriched by divine light. All right, so now we're going to sing a song before we go into meditation. We're going to sing, Thy light is in all forms, thy love in, in all beings. Um, all of you have sung this before, so this is nothing new. So, thy light is in all forms, thy love in all beings, thy light is in all forms, thy love in all beings. Who Allah, who Allah, who Allah, who who Allah, who Allah, who Allah, who thy light is in all forms, thy love in all beings, thy light is in all forms, thy love in all beings. Thy light is in all forms, thy love in all beings, thy light is in all forms, thy love in all beings. Who Allah, who Allah, who Allah, who who Allah, who Allah, who Allah, who relax as you sit comfortably. Your energy flows more smoothly if your legs and arms are not crossed. Lotus position is just fine. Close your eyes. Inhale deeply and hold your breath. Then exhale with a sigh, breathing normally in between deep breaths. Feel your body begin to relax. Inhale deeply again and hold your breath. Then exhale with a sigh. You become aware of the joy, peace, and calm that completely surround you. Inhale deeply one more time and hold your breath. And when you are ready, exhale with a sigh. Feel yourself going deeper as your body begins to tingle as each muscle relaxes. I'm going to count backward from 15 to 1 as you go even deeper. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, deeper and deeper. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, 
as you go deeper and deeper. Four, three, two, one. You are now extremely relaxed, safe, secure, and comfortable. All is well as you feel the warmth of love surround you. Imagine yourself in your special place of beauty. You might be wandering through a forest, smelling the scent of the trees tiptoeing through an enchanted jungle, exploring the mountaintops, walking by the ocean and feeling the sand beneath your feet, or sitting quietly in a beautiful meadow, inhaling sweet aroma of wild flowers. Once more, you become aware of yourself in your special place of beauty. Your attention is drawn to a large sacred circle a short distance from where you are. You go over to see it up close. As you look upon its flawless design, you become aware that it serves as both a holographic viewing area and a portal that you can use to see and visit other places and realms. Slowly, an image begins to form in the middle of the circle. Mistily at first, it slowly forms into an immense cathedral with a softly glowing golden essence. You step into this scene and you find yourself in the cathedral. The luminous brilliance of the cathedral surrounds and engulfs you. In the bright stillness, you begin to listen to the celestial choir joyfully singing. Listen to their beautiful song. Feel the peace, love, and serenity in this wonderful place as their resonances fill the sanctuary.
then in front of you appears an illuminated being of light with the brilliance of a crystalline source. The being looks gently into your eyes as you focus back into its eyes and radiant face. The linking is captivating and beautiful as you share this extended moment of intimate contact. Barely having noticed, the being has been speaking, using sacred words that communicate to your inner being. This is a special and unique initiation for you. As the choir of angels continues to sing, the enchanting multi-part harmonies invigorate your being. Feel the spirit and energies of the celestial music fill and penetrate every particle of your being as they consecrate you to receive. Slowly, the cathedral moves into silence. Not a sound anywhere. Complete stillness. The illuminated being of light softly speaks. All the angels look upward toward the cathedral ceiling. The cathedral crown slowly begins to fade. Brilliant light of unimaginable intensity gradually shines through from high above. As the ceiling continues to dissolve into nothing. The intense light shines down 
like many magnificent suns. Light beings of every imaginable type are present, watching from high above, as you are being christened in the radiance of the divine light. The illuminated being of light speaks again. You begin to be slowly raised upward, moving ever closer to the source shining intensely, radiantly above. Higher and higher upward you are raised. The light grows in intensity and luminosity. You slowly pass through the throngs of many light beings surrounding you in the air. As they rejoice at your presence on this blessed journey. As you approach the origin of this indescribable brightness, it becomes apparent to your own awareness that your being's brilliance is filled, permeated, and absorbing the radiance of the divine light that is directly above you. The brilliance communicates gently and softly with your being in a manner that is individually tailored to you. Your being is gracefully engulfed and enfolded in light and love, completely saturating you in the radiance of the divine light a brilliance that shines like many suns.
you find yourself lightly cradled in the spirit of the divine as you are brought gently back down to the cathedral where a golden choir of angels sings and the many light beings rejoice as every part of you is saturated and glowing brilliantly like embers of divine light. Spend some time and remain in the presence of angels and the radiance shining down from above to become further enriched in the divine light and this sacred experience.
You become aware of yourself once again at the sacred circle. Thank the divine, the angels, light beings, and the illuminated being of light for this wondrous immersion in the radiance of divine light. The being conducts a farewell ceremony. When you are ready, project yourself back to the outer world, illuminating the light of the divine, feeling free and released, aligned, centered and grounded. You are aware of the guidance and the wisdom in your life. You are filled with a sense of peace, love, joy and harmony. Now share your light as you return gently to the outer world. And now it is time for our closing. As always, after we meditate, our auras are poofy, really very much expanded. So it's important that we protect ourselves and still leave our light shining through before we go out and meet with other people or others who are not in the same place. So if you will, Go ahead and stand. Now imagine a great bubble of light surrounding your body, above your head, beneath your feet, and at the width of your aura. However wide you see your aura, that's how big the bubble is. Now see that bubble of light being filled from high above, from infinity, coming down a shaft of white light, filling the bubble, flowing through your body, and circulating through the bubble. Wonderful, intense white light shining outwards. This is the light of love, the light of healing, the Christ light. The light will flow, flow out from you and help others.
Now on the outside of the bubble, imagine a thin layer, however thick you see it, of indigo blue, the spiritual armor of light. It's another layer of protection that keeps all discordant energies out. The white light does it by itself, but this just adds another layer. Nothing discordant, nothing of a lower nature can enter. It will be dissolved. Next, imagine a shaft of light starting at the level of your heart or your heart chakra and the width of your aura, going down through your feet and anchoring in the center of the earth, grounding you to Mother Earth. And now feel that Mother Earth energy coming up through the shaft, through your feet, and filling your body with beautiful Mother Earth energy, grounding you to Mother Earth, keeping you centered. Now imagine another shaft of light the width of your aura starting at the level of your heart, going up through your head, through the layers of your being, through the center of the universe, and anchoring in the center of creation. Visualize it, imagine it, intend it, and it will happen. Even if you don't imagine it, just by intending it, it will happen. Then see light from the divine coming down from the center of creation, down the shaft of light through the center of the universe, down through the layers of your being, entering your crown chakra down, down into your body, mixing with the mother earth energy, and then going down through your feet into the earth. This is the walk of the masters, saying centered in the divine, as we remain grounded in Mother Earth. Now we thank the Divine, our guides, our High Self, the angels and the archangels, and the countless light beings who came from afar to support this wondrous meditation, this communion with the Divine, growing us in our spiritual path. And now Deborah is going to do the closing music. As we depart and go out into the world, may you bring that light out with you, filling all that you meet with that white light. Until we meet again, namaste. Go with the blessings of the divine. <laughs>